this video, I'm gonna show you guys how I made a short shifter from an OEM one. I already have it in the car right now, but the main process of doing it, I don't know if you could like hammer this down to extend this. I might do it with another one because you can see it has a lip right there and a lip right there. I don't know. But at least for the one I have in my car already right now, you're going to chop it right here in the middle. And it's going to be hollow. I just bought this like 30 minutes ago. I don't know if it's the right size. I did get a little thicker. I could grind off grind off like the sides to make sure it fits but I'm gonna cut it right now Hold on. yeah I didn't get it as straight as I wanted it but you see it's hollow let's hope this fits it doesn't I'm gonna return it um I would say that's good I might just have to put it all the way in there have it like locked then weld it right there. But yeah, perfect size. See, that's the, that's the size of the tube. 10 bucks for 36 inches, which is perfect, good amount. That's hot. Okay, I went to Home Depot. Got this bucket with play sand. So I'm gonna just open it up. This is gonna be for when I put the, when I'm done welding the shifter. I don't know if I need to do it to this type of metal cause I'm still kind of learning. I didn't do it to the last one that's in my car right now. But I'm gonna heat it up, weld it. I'm gonna heat it up first, weld it, then put it in this so it cools down very, very slow. So that's the game plan. Eventually I do plan on getting a bigger one, so I do want to practice with spindles. But for right now, that should be okay. This is like 14 bucks. So yeah. Last night, this is what I practiced with. I use a flux core, so it's it, there's a lot of spatter. But I don't even have a nail to test it out, but just practice welds basically. That was, yeah, that's pretty cool. I said that was good. This one. Okay, so the original one I did on that's on my car right now, I didn't bevel it. I don't know if I should bevel it or not. Since I'm extending it. So it'll be like this. And I'm gonna chop it. And well, this at the end, I'll say like, I'll do like that much. Nothing too crazy. I think that's good enough. Okay, so I'm gonna mark it on how deep this goes in there. See the line? So I'm gonna keep this in there just in case if it was to like crack or break, hopefully not. But yeah, I'm gonna keep that there. Um, I might just extend it to like this amount because this is original. So I would say that's a good amount to extend it. So I probably just add, add a little extra because it does need to go in there. So yeah, technical difficulties, but originally I have one already charged. 
But here it is. I do want to make it like, like a triangle or like a cone so it gets in there really good. At least for this part because I see how it goes down. So yeah. But I need to bevel it a little bit too. Or make it like a cone. So I gotta put the other, other wheel on now. So it's gonna look like that. That might be a little too extended. Mm. No, it's okay. If it's too extended, I could probably just make another one. Retry it again. Vision's like this. Um, yeah, I'm gonna just keep it like this actually. Okay, that was just a little bit. That would do good. Yeah. Gonna use the new hammer that I watered up last night. Okay, now I'm just gonna water like that. Yeah, that's a perfect length. Yeah, it's perfect. Hammering it down was a good thing to do. Okay. Um... Okay, I'm gonna take the other side. I did fill it up pretty good. I'm a uh, uh, grind it down a bit, but I think that should be good enough to be honest. You know, I'm you know I'm not a you know professional welder. I'm learning right now. This should hold up. I mean, I'm, I don't smack gears in my Honda because uh, I already have one in my car right now. I'm just redoing it thicker because I didn't do all this. I didn't fill it up, so just doing it thicker right now. Okay, I just finished welding it up. I couldn't talk with welding because I have my respirator on. It's in the bag, but I filled it up pretty good, I would say. Now it's uh, time to put it in the sand, hopefully. Hopefully this doesn't crack it. I really hope not. I'm gonna be upset if it does. Oh yeah, that's right. That's good. Okay, that's about it. I guess so. Next video, I'll probably put it back on or up. Put it on, so that's it. Thank you for watching.